That was a bit of a demonstration uh, with the, the. Okay, with my pinky little finger, I'm holding the wheel, and if I just let it go. Really good. Uh, the the race car, the toy itself is a bit heavy, so maybe it takes time for this one to just jump start with the engine and stuff. Now this one has been separated. I don't know where it can. It's falling apart. I got. I think I got the uh, the reply message from the cell, uh, the sender. I got the, the reply <laughs> message from the person who I've just sent message to. Uh, I said thank you and appreciate it and this person says yes with the smile image. Alright, this is uh, uh, good, this is good. But uh, in between, uh, the, some pieces have just been uh, separated. I think I, I, uh, it looks like it came from here. And uh, the on the bottom one. All right. Uh, with the pin goes first. This one. I think this one is once uh it it hits a uh, an obstacle or a wall, then it gives the uh, the spinning uh the the spinning wheel right here is functioning as the uh direction like so that the uh, the car could move to a different direction like a what do you call it joyamta like a handler like a direction like uh, i forgot but I, I think this is how it is supposed to be working with all the pins and nuts and bolts and i think this one goes on top and squeeze 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 it and i don't know where this came from where are you from on top doesn't look like this one just fell off from somewhere. So this is a nice race. Who wants it? I'd like to give it away. <laughs> I don't need this. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll keep it. It says Tamiya. Tamiya is Tamiya good? I don't know. I see. So this one's supposed to be stuck in between. So let me just unsqueeze the nuts back out. Put it out, and this one goes in there. It's um, some kind of holder. It doesn't go completely in. Maybe I put it in the wrong direction. It's supposed to get stuck here or here. Ah, uh, too much work. Too much work. All right, I haven't got time for all the stuff. Let me just uh, stick it up here. Okay, I don't know. Let's no wonder it comes off. I don't know, it looks just the same. Or somehow... Uh, maybe... Upside down, like this, and... Put it on top, and... The... This one comes... It's too complicated. Uh, Or, uh, I have um, grown old, grown out of this, and grown too old to play with this kind of stuff. Uh, I, I still don't know what these are. I'll just uh, put it back in. I'm gonna... No, 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 the battery out, the battery out. It's not here. So the battery, I'm going to use the battery for something else. Now how do I... Alright, how do I open this? Let me get the battery out. Like this. Just put it back in. Uh, the battery which has been used up, I probably have to throw it away. Because... The battery is... Dirty. No, I mean, like... Taking up weights and... Uh, garbage? Yeah, I have to throw it away. The radioactive stuff. <laughs> Alright. 
So this one, I'm just gonna wipe it, clean it. Now that I can uh, dismantle everything in here. All right. So it's a, it's an F1 trailer. So these are garbage with the garbage bag. Okay, convenient. And we use the uh, orange brick human tool. And I will need uh, two more separate bags for the train and stuff. Enlighten. So yeah, let me just get this first. Gotta get back to work. Ah, uh, in the night. Another night. Oh, this is one piece. Alright. Uh, this one is sticker. So, stickers are... I have to be careful. <coughs> ah, chainsaw, human tool. Unfortunately, I could not find any minifigure in here. Uh, this one's a real Lego piece. With the Lego logo on the stud. Plate pieces like this should be quite useful if it has been a uh, genuine piece. Alright, I'm ready have to use the, uh, the orange human tool. This is getting a bit too hard on my finger already. Okay. Uh, already a lot of pieces are, have been combined together. Okay, the sticker pieces like that has to be separated. I cannot put them into the hot water. I'm gonna put them into hot water, all those stuff, but not the sticker pieces. <clears throat> Alright, let's send them. So, just uh, dusting up. Just remove the uh, dust on the surface. Uh, I think just rinsing with the water would be good enough. I don't think this is for, the, for this piece. For this side. All those. Out of 5,000 songs from the YouTube library, uh, now that I get all the classic and interesting music coming up from the repertoire. To see the dark blue uh, truck main piece. These are stuck together. I have to separate. Ouch! It hurts. This is the occupational safety issue I'm all coming up here. See those. Ow. I already got like. Ow. It's getting warm in here. Occupational health and safety issue rising up while dismantling the fake Lego pieces. The Ox Oxford pieces. The square is really hard and sharp and all. It could um, get uh, scratches and get hurt. Might get hurt from those pieces. So, like that's why I do not really recommend uh, this to kids. At least the tire is not cracked at all. Nothing. All right. Nothing seems to have been cracked. Let me just separate everything here. There are like 10 tires, as I remember. And it's uh, all the sticker pieces. This one reminds me of the uh, the official genuine Lego set named uh, Gear Grinder. I think that was also an, a Lego idea set or cr creator set. Gear Grinder. Especially those wheel pieces and those wedge piece that goes on top of a car. Uh, this looks uh, comp, comp, uh, the uh, the 
uh, proportion, the the rate, uh, what do you call it? The uh, the set overall, the aspect of the whole thing looks like an imitation copy of uh, Gear Grinder, the official genuine Lego set. This one, but this one is uh, F1 stuff. Actually, this is not a sticker, which is good. This is a printed pattern on top of this uh, big panel, which doesn't is hard to get off. All right, just make sure there is no genuine Lego piece got stuck in here somewhere. I have to check each and every piece right here, and this one is actually a genuine Lego piece with the Lego logo on the bottom of the uh, piece right here. One by one tile, white has Lego logo. Oh my god! And you see right here, there's another <laughs> another one by six plate. With the Lego logo. How about this one? This one is also a Lego genuine piece of Lego with the Lego logo on the bottom of the. It's really difficult to show you here, but but I can see. I, at least I can see it. So yeah. What about the other one? Okay. Interestingly enough, this is not Lego. Non-Lego piece. All right. Let me continue on with the. Focus. Let me continue with the rest of this stuff. I wish I could have that uh, AI voice recognition function on my mobile phone. So whenever I say focus, it focuses automatically. I want that happen with my phone. So like, there's really, it's really difficult. How to, like, ouch! I got another. <laughs> Uh, I got hurt. I need compensation. No, that's okay. All right, separate this. And how about the hinge piece right here? It's 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 a there's a pin in there. It's just one piece, one complete piece that I cannot separate somehow. And here's another plate piece right here. And this one is just came out like this probably. There's I cannot separate this. Now that I know what set these are, this is, and uh, I've requested for the instruction, there's no regret. I can uh, separate everything. Just dismantle it. All right, here's a sticker, and there's another sticker here, three, 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 four. So the reason why I'm separating the sticker pieces is. Because those Oxford set stickers are paper stickers and if they get into the hot water they become very easily torn apart or damaged making a very bad looking uh, make it like all dirty surface leaving, leaving a dirty sticky area on the surface um, at least, and I mean, basically, I just do not want to damage the sticker itself, so that's why I'm going to have to be careful washing them separately in a sensitive measure. So let me just first separate all those pieces to make sure these are non-Lego pieces. These are non-Lego pieces. There's another thing that I'm stuck on here. So I already got like Oxford uh, camping car <laughs> from the last. I think it's the same sender who sent me the camping car and robot series. Three robot, Oxford police robot, and what else did I get? Oh, the uh, the boat, the Coast Guard truck. No, no, the boat. And this time is a F1 racer trailer. So plate.
See right here, these are real Lego pieces combined together, assembled pieces. So sometimes real pieces are mixed together, mixed up together. Uh, 255, piece number 2555, I've recognized it. This one as well has the logo on the bottom of the piece. This one has a sticker. Alright, back focus. Motorcycle. This is actually lovely, quite lovely. A blue motorcycle. Maybe a police. Police usually rides on the, the white motorcycle. I think. This one also has a sticker. Yeah, separated. And here on the tile, there's a set sticker. So these are. It's extremely difficult to. Ah, oh my god, finger! It's just square pieces. It's not quite flexible. And you cannot expect flexibility with those pieces. Just. Ow! My finger hurting. Come on, Oxford. Maybe that's what Lego company has been working on as well. Make it a bit like uh, finger friendly, human body friendly, to make it a bit soft on the edges and stuff. But this one, you cannot expect, you cannot really, there's none of it. Just square, plastic, hard as rock pieces. There's like square and sharp on the edges as well. It's like hurts your finger, especially when it's like stuck strongly together like this. You really have to be careful, like you might get cut as well. Cut on the surface of your skin or yeah, minor cut damage on your fingers, stuff like that. Especially those pieces that got stuck together like this. You have to use your human tool to separate them. Always use a smart and safe method of handling fake pieces, especially like these. Here's a sticker on each side. The rest of them are just uh, chunks of pieces. How do I separate those? Pretty much done. Alright, no more sticker. Just double checking, there is no more sticker. Okay, that's done. Done for Now the Enlighten! For these, I need extra bags. Uh. Uh, for the stickers... Pieces and the genuine pieces uh, for the Star Wars and all those pieces can yeah I can put them together and enlighten. I'll probably uh, let me just use another place back here. So uh, these Chinese uh, block pieces and Korean block pieces. They don't get mixed up together, so that it will be easier for me to uh, build them later. Let me just separate them. It's fine. Okay. Move up here. Wow, the train imitation pieces. It's kind of oxymoron. I hate imitations, but I love train. So what am I gonna do? Enlighten. 
from China. All the way from China. I cannot separate this. Anyway, anyway I can separate this more easily. Maybe I should just uh, press it with this. Smart. And I think I should just. Uh, and this is a bit sensitive, but that's okay. Let's just print, print it. Let's just, just get the pick first. Come on. Uh, it has a bit of a different feeling of um, connectability. How tight it is. Everything's different. Oxford. Enlighten. This one is a, a bit more uh, loose, but still is sometimes it's, it's just irregular, irregular. Sometimes stuffy, sometimes loose. That's what is bad about the fake pieces. Uh, just irregular. I cannot expect. So there's no expectation of you cannot get used to it. Every time is different. With Lego, it, it doesn't happen like that. You already know how it feels or what the system is like. I mean, what the, you have experienced. It identical. All the pieces are identical, same. Uh, supposed to be same level of connectability, clickability, how they are connected. So they're very regular with the uh, the pieces. Regardless of uh, where the pieces are uh, produced, whether it was produced in Czech Republic, whether it was produced in Japan, Korea, even China, they are compatible to the utmost. So compatible. I didn't really realize that these are separable pieces actually built together. All right, so these are the train wheel pieces. I can even separate the wheels as well, but it, which doesn't seem really necessary, but I'm going to do it anyway. Even the wheel. All right, it comes off, but uh, just to stick it together. Uh, when I wash them, I have to be careful not to lose them, so this might go off or go away in the sink, so I have to just let, let it connect together and wash them all together. See, I'm already getting, uh, like, my finger is, uh... <laughs> rough and... I guess rough. On my finger, it might get, it gets, it's like, like And, uh, looks kind of dirty and blackish. <laughs> See, this happens. It's getting warm in here. I need another shower with hot water ow the engine part is gonna be difficult all right just roughly do it all those pieces all right uh this particular piece in genuine lego piece would be very precious for me i love to uh, which is extremely rare all right, the rest of our, the rest of them are just gen, uh, general brick pieces. All right, I'm just gonna throw them back in there. You get in. Strange music makes me feel like I'm in the space. Robotic, rep rep repetitive sound of music. Hmm. Okay. Sounds like exploration, explorational theme. It just doesn't come off easily. Those engine. Ah, the one by one. So this one, these ones are strongly attached. My finger 
whenever I'm handling those fake fake pieces, I get so much stress on my hand and fingers. So much. The irregularity is the actual problem with the compatible this compatibility of those pieces fake pieces are sometimes it's loose sometimes it's strong you cannot really know the customer experience is going to be really really bad that's why they are, they are the pri retail price is cheaper for those pieces i got it i got it and the last nanoblux I'm gonna have to wash those uh, zipper bags as well. And uh, use another plastic bag for designated for the normal blocks. Um, at the moment, I do not have a uh, brick separator for the normal blocks. So I don't know what to do. I cannot. <laughs> no, it doesn't work. I mean, I can't, I can't separate it. I'm just gonna wash that, wash them as, I, I, as they are, like this. All right, so <clears throat> all the block pieces are ready to be washed for the next stage of uh, washing. So these are all the. Things I'm supposed to wash. All right, so these are. I'm going to wipe them, wipe clean them, and this one I'm going to give away. Wipe clean them. Garbage. And these are the bags for that have to be washed. Oh, so many bags. And this one as well. Now the. Let me put them all back. Ow! Oh, it's a hard work. Tough work. And I'm gonna put them. Okay, now I'm ready. My sister has not responded me back with any message yet. So I'm gonna have to wait on that. That's it, I'm gonna I'm gonna move along. I'm gonna have to recharge the uh, the battery at the same time. Okay. All right. I'll see you at the next one. Thanks.